Hello everyone, YGO, Dragon Ruler here again. Um, as I discussed in my previous video, we bought a, if you guys have seen it, investing into Yu-Gi-Oh! We bought an entire case of this terrible, terrible set. And we will be trying to make our money back and then some off of it. But, uh, but yeah, I don't think, and again, not, not telling anyone to go out and do, it, and go out and do this. I don't think we'll be able to break even at least for a couple weeks in, then maybe start seeing a profit until a couple months. Because there's certain stuff in this set that we're going to hold on to because we think it has, you know, future value like the true Draco Ignis, um, Ignis Heat. I think, I think that card is tremendously undervalued right now. So we're definitely not going to be selling that. But uh, there's certain things we're going to move right away. So yeah, with that being said... Let's get into the video here, and we'll uh, we'll put our lucky dice. It's now our. That's I've decided that's now our lucky dice because we got it for free. Um, essentially, I'm gonna grab the first pack here. We're not looking for anything too crazy. I do want the fire fist stuff, but I also want the the scrap recyclers because they're super valuable right now. I think <laughs> scrap recycler is the third most valuable card in the set aside from the 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 fire the two fire fist stuff being first we have um we have air supreme venom dragon that's pretty cool gadgets which we don't you don't particularly care for more fire fist stuff and fire formation ingen we'll put the secret trailer here we'll put the actually we'll put the secret rare here We'll put the worthless, unvalued <laughs> supers over here, and the ones with some value we'll leave over here. And again, in this set, there's not a whole lot, just because of uh, the nature of it. I don't think anything too great was reprinted in here. So we have a shooting code talker, aside from, of course, the true Draco stuff. Um, I'm going to put this here, even though it's worthless, because I think it has great future value. Um, I also think this might have good future value, but uh, no, no, I don't know. It'll take a lot. It'll take a lot. And then we have the terrible boot up order gear force over here. Drop that down there. Um, next pack. Uh, let's see. Oh, Master Cerberus. That's a good one. I do think this will continue to rise over time, but uh, right now it's a solid three to four dollar card. Um, gadget stuff. Gadget. Gadget. And a fire formation card that's not worth any value. I'm pretty sure you guys have seen many of these openings already, so I'm not gonna I'm not gonna spend too much time explaining too much cards. Unless they're uh, of value. This is actually one of the best selling cards on TCG player right now, and I'm not too sure why. Not worth it. Not worth it. You know, even even your ultra rare isn't that much. I expected these. I mean, they suck, but they're nice. The art on these are just, they're beautiful, but they're just, they're just not good. They're just not good. Let me uh, push that up there. Next one. So if you guys didn't know, we paid about $30, I want to say about $30 a box. And so essentially we just need $30 back in value out of this box. And I don't think we're going to be that lucky. Right now we're at about, I want to say $4. Because most of these, most of these, these, these supers right here, they go for cents. This might maybe like 50 cents to a dollar. This... I don't think this has any value whatsoever. And then this is like a dollar at best. So yeah. It's gonna be it's gonna be quite quite difficult. What is this? Ultimate fire. I didn't know they had a trap. Oh but I guess they do, they do have traps. Um it's just how good are those traps really. Gold gadget guys. They're coming in secret rare in the what is it? The Dark Side of Dimension secret rare version. So stay tuned for that. That's actually decent. 20, 20, 
25 cents. Not. Ooh, here's the other Archfiend. Archfiend Awakening. Like I said, the art on these are amazing. But I guess the usability of them is just, it's just non-existent. Next pack. Again, I think... I don't think this is very legal, but I do... It is going to sell quickly. Slot. Slot's about a dollar. And then... Eland? Yeah, I don't think you're actually valuable, buddy, but... We'll, uh... We'll hope. We'll hope for, I mean, we, I was really hoping the Fire Fest would do something, but, uh... They even promoted it at the... What is it? The, the World Championship. They had, uh... When they had the YouTubers out, they, uh... They were promoting them hard. But... Sadly... It, nothing, nothing came of it. No amount. That just goes to show you. No amount of promotion can make it that good. Oh, look at this one. Archfiend Call. Man. They look amazing. They suck. But they look amazing. Next up here. Ooh, Hidden City. That's also a pretty good one. The fact that most of these supers have a better value than... The secrets is kind of like that should that should raise some eyebrows there. Green gadget guys. Hey, 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 Ram, Ram was Ram a good one? I don't even. I'm not a Fire Fist player. Ram? No, I think it was Elephant, Elephant, and Panda. Those were the good ones. So he unfortunately he didn't make the cut. What's up here? Oh yeah, again, I see value in this. Nobody else will right now, but there's value in this. Maybe value in this, but I don't see it. I don't see it in that one. I see it in this one. Are we almost are we almost halfway halfway through here and we made no type of headways? Final battle. There's also value in this. This is this guy. Code radiator. If um if Cybers ever do anything, this card will go up in value. So I do think I think I'm gonna hold on to those with the hope, the hope that the next set, the next Cyber support set, the one I think after Mystic Fighter in uh, Ignition Assault, they do something. Ooh, hey, hey, this is what we like to see. This is what we like to see. This is <laughs> this is 10% of our box back right there. 10%, whole 10% in this one card. Now, now, now the tides are changing. Ah, oh, Ignis too. Oh man, our luck, our luck is changing now, because now I value that. I value those cards at the price of the box in in the long term, the long term. So let's see if we can we can net a profit, because I do think this will go this will go up to like five, six, maybe even ten dollars again. This is about seven to ten dollars. So combined with the other stuff, I think all we'd need to pull. It's like one more good card. One more five to ten dollar card. And we're in the positive guys. We're in the we're in the plus. But uh unfortunately these these are not the cards. These are not the ones. But we still have one, two, three, four, five. We still have six boxes here. So let's uh um, pop it open. Again, I don't like making these videos too long, so I'm just gonna just gonna rip into it and hope for the best. Code talker. No, you know we didn't even get a fire formation tanky, and I don't even think that's short printed in here. But uh, that is also something with the new set that has a uh, support. <laughs> Speaking of tanky, this card, guys, I would. This card was a dollar. It's now two dollars. I predict this card will be five dollars by the time the new set drops. Don't quote me on that. I might, might not happen. It's a lot of print in a tanky. But I think the secret rare being the second highest, I can see the potential being there. All right, silver gadget, guys. Got to have your, got to have your silver gadget and your Archfiend Awakening. Just look at that shine, man. All of that, not going anywhere. We need get three more pack, guys. Come on, let me get a uh, one more scrap recycler. Goliath. I forget, I forget these cards are even in. You know, that's why this set sucks so much. Like, all, all the side, the, 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 the gadgets, the Archfiend, and even the Firefizz, they're not, 
they're not doing that. They're not doing that. When you're not doing that, ain't nobody, nobody really want want to buy a set chronograph and swan swan he isn't good don't get him don't be happy about that the lucky the lucky dice didn't didn't do the because the scale was upside down you see where we have the scale i've got to got to flip it around this pack right here is going to be it's going to be a godly pack it's going to have everything and it. it's going to have cerberus the <laughs> no <laughs> no <laughs> i mean I don't think, I don't think it was too bad, right? We got, uh, we did get one scrap recycler. We got a hidden city. That alone is about 15 bucks. 16. Say about $20 there in value, right? And then you take this, which has the tanky, which I think will continue to rise, Ignis. Code Radiator, which is a short print. So if, um, what's important with this card is if Cyber Monsters ever do anything, shoots up. True Jacobs continue to, continue to be in the metagame, shoots up. And, that's it. The rest, we had more good super rares than secret rare guys. Let that sink in there for a second. We had more good super rares than secret rares in this box. That's... That's crazy. Anyway, talk to you guys in the next one. We're gonna have another box. We're doing the whole box. Oh, I, I saw it. I saw it and I thought, oh, there's one more pack. But it was just, it was just lies. It was just lies. Talk to you guys in the next one. Goodbye.